My name is Tom Gaynor, and I'm the curator of education here at the Textile Museum. The Textile Museum is such a special place. I don't know where else you could go and find out uh, from beginning to end what textiles are made of, what cultures produce them, and why they're significant. Our world is surrounded from head to toe virtually with textiles. And so you can answer all those basic questions and at the same time have a sense of delight in discovering something beautiful. This space is our textile learning center and it's equipped with a variety of looms and uh, visual pieces that people can come to and have a full tactile experience. The Cornerstone or Showcase program that we love uh, and has been running for over 30 years now is our celebration of textiles. This big open house where we showcase everything from sheep shearing and then you can see the wool being uh, carded, cleaned, spun, and we call it from sheep to shawl. It's great and there are a bunch of hands-on activities. A lot of kids today um, don't really have an intimate relationship with their textiles. Um, you'd be surprised how many don't sew, don't weave, never made those little pot holders that you and I did when we were kids. So this is all new territory for them. I would be amiss to say that I, you know, that I do this all alone, but I am not a solo act. I rely heavily on volunteers and docents. If, you know, the passion for textiles here at this museum is the heart the volunteers and docents are the muscle. They get everything done. The museum, for the past um, 10 years or more, has been working with DC public schools. We send docents uh, to the school, uh, and they teach a lesson on basic textiles. They come back periodically uh, to help them with a project, um, which turns into a banner that goes on exhibit here at the museum. So they're able to come to the museum, see the art that's on the wall, and then transmit some of that uh, into their own art project uh, with the help of our docents and the museum. Certainly, uh, the future of the Textile Museum and its educational programs is, is going to have to expand and include more young people so that we can get that next generation in here and appreciating the textiles that that make such a major part of their culture that they may not even be aware of. I certainly hope that uh, after they leave our museum and experience the textiles on exhibit and our own learning center, that they'll see what a huge role textiles play in their everyday lives. Thank you.